Marcus, I got Jimmy out safe. Thanks, Miranda. Hey, you did all the legwork. Here, he wants to talk to you. Marcus, if that's your name. I want to burn these bastards and I know where to start. I'll meet you outside the Temple of New Dawn. Man, you should file a police report. We just proved the church keeps prisoners. I've got footage. We'll release a video soon to let the world know. What else do we need? I can lead you to the heart of the religion. The holy relics. The original source. Now how am I gonna resist an offer like that? I'll see you there. Five minutes without bugging me, okay? I've got the map right here. <laughs> what the? Jesus! Another launch. Looks like Galilee's keeping busy. Psst. Kid, it's me. I'm over here. Jimmy Siska. I'm in disguise. Yeah, I can see that. <sighs> Beautiful, isn't it? That house is built on lies, and it's time for, for a confession. confession. <laughs> Man, Open Wounds 3, that, that is a modern classic. Classic. <sighs> I'm sorry, kid, I didn't, I didn't know you were such a fan. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was. I guess I fucked up, didn't I? Seems to be a running theme in that. There's always time for a fresh start, like right here. Right here and right now. Mm -hmm. You know, kid, maybe not right here and right now. I don't know if I can go back in there. It's all good. Just tell me what to look for. I got you. Right. Ah. Uh... Right, okay, so uh, there's a lift that will take you down into the basement. In the basement, there's a room. Inside the room, there are ancient Sumerian tablets said to have been written by the visitor himself. No, hey, man, I'm serious, and they, they are deadly serious. Okay, man. No, I believe you, that's perfect. Okay. Look, if you need anything else, you let me know. Just ask someone for direct bugging me, okay? I've got the map right here. Okay, gang, I'm about to sneak inside New Dawn's temple. And Jimmy's agreed to deliver a special message for our video. We're all set up once you raid the treasure. Watch out for snakes. There are always snakes. <laughs> it's not that kind of temple, Wrench. That does not preclude snakes. I'll be careful.
That's gotta be Jimmy's elevator. I've unlocked the secret lift. I can't believe you actually said that. What? It's true. Welcome to the fifth level of the new dawn, and congratulations on your spiritual ascendance. Thank you. I worked hard for it. Exemption to our donations? No, it's automatically deducted. It's in your contract. But they know exactly how much we're paid, so they know we'll never be able to reach the higher levels. We keep them safe. Shouldn't we be allowed to move up in the church? That's a good question. Never thought about it like that. Wouldn't hurt to ask. So, can you ask? No. Hey, what's that? Hey, you catch that? We're looking at New Dawn's prized possessions. The foundation of their entire religion. Rows of ancient Sumerian tablets. There's a lot of crazy shit in here, but this, no, this, this is something special. Why aren't they in a museum? I mean, what gives the church the right to keep these hidden away from us? Let's find out. Oh, it says do not touch, but I really want to touch. I mean, just a little. Come on. So much rich history. I mean, I am so glad to be a part of all the... Oh, no, 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 no! They're fucking fake. <laughs> this is all bullshit. People commit to New Dawn, pay millions of dollars before they get to see these, and they're fake. As fake as everything else the church promises. <clears throat> yeah. Now I feel better. Let's go home. decided to dig into the church of the New Dawn and found crime and corruption at its core. They purchased large amounts of personal data to better target their enemies. They may already have a file on you. On you. We will proceed to leak everything we collected to our usual dispatches. Read them. Read them. Verify them. Verify them. 
you will come to the same conclusion we did. New Dawn is a criminal organization designed to intimidate its own members into destroying their own lives and handing over their savings. <laughs> but don't take our word for it. We have a celebrity guest. Yes. Hello, I'm Jimmy Siska. You probably remember me from a bunch of good movies I made before I was brainwashed by New Dawn and forced to tow the company line. When friends of mine questioned the church's cruel practices, they disappeared. When I questioned that, I was taken against my will and locked away. Know that the police are already investigating my claims. And what is the church all about? What's behind door number five? I'll let my friends in DeadSec demonstrate. DeadSec has given you the truth. God. Come on, guys. You're fucking welcome. Yo, Sitar, I was curious about your posters. They're good. <laughs> Real good. Like art. <laughs> Fuck off. They are art. <laughs> I don't know, man. I've never done the street art thing before. You'll just have to be my student then. Sending you a meeting spot. See you there. If you think you can hack it. Nine one one. please state the nature of your emergency. We have you on CTOS. Police will be there shortly. Marcus, have you looked at our follower count lately? Yeah, we're making waves. We've got to make people see Bloom for what it is, Marcus. The longer it takes, the more they rely on CTOS. They'll get used to things the way they are, and then DeadSec becomes a conspiracy theory fringe. It won't matter if what we're saying is true, if people don't want it to be. Yeah, but this is just the start. When we show them the shit that's brewing behind Bloom's doors, they'll join us in droves. Francisco group of hackers has exposed New Dawn's religious secrets. 
DedSec revealed footage of New Dawn's temple area and demonstrated that the so-called ancient artifacts were simply fakes of what New Dawn claimed were ancient tablets. Members of the hacker group managed to infiltrate the highly guarded compound and capture the secretive organization's methods of control over members, including movie star Jimmy Siska. New Dawn declined our requests for an interview. Yo, Wrench. Yo, Em. Damn, man, I hope you kept the receipts. Hey, yo, check out this fuck stick. So tell us about Home 2.0. <laughs> Home systems are completely bulletproof. Your privacy is absolutely secure. Bold claim, Steven. Aren't you worried hacker groups will see that as a challenge? Well, say what you mean, Shirley. Dead sec. Now, if they want to go up against us, I invite them to try. <laughs> Home 2.0 is an OS with teeth. Yo, he called us out by name? Yep. He don't know who he fucking with. It's on now. Yeah, that's why I've been trying to crack 2.0. There's just one... See? Little problem. What? Here. Hold this. Stand back. Great. Chip! It's a little... Hard to get out. Look, there's no point in trying to use the previous version's hardware to jack the new OS. Why? Because they changed the ports. Following the capital sky to force obsolescence. But luckily, a little birdie told me that 2.0 should be packing a farm fresh zero day. Ooh, now that might just be a shame. Damn right. And that is why you, my friend, are going to hijack me a 2.0 pre-order shipment before some do-gooder white hat tells home how to cock block us. Got a weird relationship with technology. You know that, right? He didn't mean it. <laughs> People still seem shocked by in-home surveillance. It's been happening for years. Maybe, but there's a difference between worrying about it and finding out it's worse than you feared. It's always worse than you feared. So they need to either accept it or modify all their electronic devices to stop reporting back what they see. I don't think most people know how to do that. We can teach them. Let's teach them. I'll set up a wiki, starting with home. Marcus, the followers just keep on coming. <laughs> That's gonna get a reaction from Bloom. I can't believe people let them grab so much power. All that sci-fi shit we read as kids, Big Brother, Thought Control, Pre-Crime, it's all here now, isn't it? 
thanks to Bloom and their CTOS. Those authors saw it coming decades ago, but nobody listened. Everybody's too sold on pleasant corporate platitudes and flawless branding to realize the whole damn thing's a societal Trojan. It doesn't help that CTOS actually does what they say it does either. We're opposing a system that helps people on the surface, but exploits them behind the scenes. Makes it easy to paint us as the bad guys. Question for you. How much access does DedSec have to CTOS? In other cities, when it was still CTOS 1.0, we had a lot. Sucks because we were too careless. Missed our window to do something big. 2.0. We're the first group to go up against it. So we're still playing catch up. They were expecting us this time. <laughs> the thought of DedSec written on a whiteboard in some Bloom office makes me all squishy inside. We keep it up. Next time, maybe they'll use the red marker. Okay, I'm at Holmes Distribution Center. Great. Okay, uh, so take a look around for a computer, one of those old crap box ones. Now, Holmes stores their schedules based on number plate destination combinations, like some kind of barely literate moron. If that moron was, you know, a company. <laughs> Good to know. I'll see what I can find. Where are you? Got it. I got the list. Okay, great. So now all you have to do is stroll over to the distribution center and match the number plate of one of their trucks to the one that's headed downtown. Man, this is so analog. I told you. Luddites.
Just trying to take all corners? I found the truck. Great! And what are you waiting for? Smash and grab, my friend! I got the shipment and I'm inbound. I already the welcoming committee. Wait 
tell me I got something good. Nope. Crash. Crash. Oh, ho, ho. Well, you got the goods. Is it actually good? It might be evil. I don't know. This is home we're talking about. All right, well, I will get this little fucker prepped while you go get us some caffeine. Uh, wait, you want me to get you two coffee? No, he's a robot. I want you to get us caffeine. You'll take a decaf. 